In this video, I'll show you how to fade from one video to another in Kden Live using the wipe composition. Welcome to this video. My name is David and I hope you're well wherever you are around the world. So this is Kden Live and the version I'm using is Kden Live version 22.04.1. So uh, let's just drag our video clips that we want to fade. And more or less, if you're working on a project, uh, the project is already available for you on the timeline. Now, one thing you need to know is that the clip that you want to fade from needs to be at the top. So uh, let's say we want uh, to fade uh, from this particular clip. Let's put it here. Uh, let's actually pull it up uh, so that it goes to uh, the track two. I can just right click on this and group clips. And then we can delete this audio uh, because there's nothing there. Uh, next up, we can just drag the second video onto this particular section. Uh, and once we do that, we repeat the process and remove or ungroup these clips, delete uh, this particular audio. Now, let me show you first. Let me actually uh, have this both on the same track. So here we go. Now, if I zoom in slightly, when you hover over uh, a video, uh, let's just move uh, this particular uh, clip here. If you hover over the edge of any of these clips, the lower edge, you'll see a new uh, dot and uh, this also happens on this. And if I click on it, what we get is the wipe uh, composition. Now, note what happens. If I play this video and uh, with a wipe composition, it starts fading out to black. And once it does that, it moves on to the next clip. And if you actually click on, uh, click on this other clip uh, to get another wipe, this is what happens. You get the wipe as well. And we can actually uh, keep playing this and it starts to fade in and fade out. It's more or less our fade in and fade out. But we want this particular video, the first video, this one, to dissolve into this particular clip. So uh, let us remove this and the other downside with this particular composition is if you move your clip, it leaves uh, this particular composition down there. So, uh, but more or less, that is how it's supposed to work. So uh, let's make sure that uh, we get it right. So let's bring this up and then we can bring this uh, this in this direction. And then we can clip, uh, click on this uh, clip here to add the wipe duration. Now, see what happens if I play this video. Now, what happens is that this clip now will seamlessly cross dissolve, showcasing the video at the bottom without the black, uh, that is the fade in or fade out to black. See how simple it is? It's pretty simple. The only thing you need to remember is that if you do this, uh, one thing is that if you move your clip, the wipe is actually left remaining there. And I've already walked you through another simpler method, which is using the transform effect where you need to just bring down the opacity and use some keyframes. And this really works well, even when you move your clips around. So that is how you can use the wipe composition to fade uh, from one video to another in Kden Live. Thanks for watching. I hope this video is of value to you.